Occasionally, I'm asked the question, why do I paint dancers and trees? And the more I think about it, the more I realize, how can I not paint dancers and trees? How, how do you not see dancers or movement? These physical expression that you can train for and become really good at. And then when you're really good at it, to express it fully. And that makes art. And it's, we get the ballet, and modern dance, and choreography, and we get the gymnastics, Olympics, the Olympiads and their routines, and the ice skaters in the Winter Olympics, gracefully move, maneuvering around the ice. And I see it in landscape too. And see day to day, especially in the spring, when the new growth begins to come out. Or when you're driving down the road in the spring and you have all that brand new green growth and it's real small and you can't even tell that there are leaves yet. And then in the summer, they're in full, full glory. They're at their richest greens and and their, their leaves are their broadest so they can soak in the sunlight. And, and then the fall, and they begin to change colors as they die. And, and we celebrate the death of them by really revering their colors of red and yellow and orange and shades of brown and rust. So nature really is full of Art. The greatest artist <laughs> is, a, is the source energy that we come from that man has called God. And this source energy, it gets through all of us and in all things. And when we're in alignment with source energy and we, f we know we're in alignment because of our guidance system, if you feel good and you feel joyful, then you know that you're in alignment when you're at a performance and you're clapping your hands or you're watching a show and it is so good, it just moves you. All of those moments, you know you are in alignment with your source energy, your highest inner being. But I also know that contrast, which is un can be uncomfortable, gives us more ideas of other avenues that we could take and directions and, and you get choices in how you want to adjust the current circumstances. So it keeps life always alive and amusing, exciting, and never boring, and, but reaching always for what makes you feel good. Because when you're in that place of feeling good and you're in alignment with your source energy, then you have access to all that you want. Yeah, that's why I paint. I paint to express the absolute joy and beauty that I see in nature and I feel it when I dance. And so I combine the two. And it is such a joyous expression.